Well, you've heard of brick and mortar. How about click and mortar? It's how an internet blog about area wines turned into a new tasting room in downtown Spokane. KXY4's Eric Loney is live at Nectar to talk about the new business in area wines. Good morning, guys. Yeah, good morning, Mike. This is Josh Wade. Josh runs Nectar Wine Tasting, well known in the community and the wine community because of his very popular wine blog. And Josh, that's how this started, wasn't it? You started out with an uh, internet blog and now you have your own tasting room. Exactly. I did it actually intentionally um, to brand uh, this business. You know, it's changed and morphed over the years, but started a wine blog, um, started interviewing Spokane wineries and doing wine business and, and wine tasting reviews. Uh, that traffic just continued to grow and grow and uh, for me I thought if I could open this business with a hundred people that knew who I was I'd be better off than some other guy opening a business and that hundred people turned into much more because you have quite a following yeah, There's about 10,000 people a month that actually come to the site and there's 4,000 people each on Facebook and Twitter that hang on every word I say I wish but, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now this is also a new tasting room for downtown Spokane how many do we have down here now if I'm counting correctly we have 10 wineries slash tasting rooms in the downtown core and so with these five new Washington State wineries that are here, it brings about 18 different wineries that you can taste while you're in downtown. And these, are, these ones are from out of the area? Right. We have wines from uh, anywhere from uh, here we've got uh, Kennewick, um, Lake Chelan, uh, we've got Nor uh, Kirkland, Walla Walla, and just outside the Tri-Cities. And uh, obviously high tech has been one of your things. Tell me about your menus. We have our menus on iPad as well as paper, so customers can go in and they can rate wines, they can learn about the wines, all the tasting notes are in there. Uh, you can obviously learn about the wineries. Um, we want to provide an educational opportunity since those wineries don't actually have a physical presence you know, here in Spokane. Okay. And how many wines do we have in Washington State now? I mean, it just continues to grow. Yeah, there is about 700 labels identified as you know wineries, but a lot of those are owned similar to the same you know, same company owns maybe a dozen of them or something. So. Okay. All right, Josh. Thanks very much. And you're open what days? We're open Thursday from noon to seven, Friday and Saturday from noon to nine, and we have live music every Friday and Saturday from six to nine. Okay. It's right at the corner of Stevens and Main, right in downtown. Spokane. You can't miss it if you're headed southbound.